Hey everyone, this is Paul Kepner with PK Productions. Today I was going to talk to you about a, a lens that I picked up that's pretty cool. I've actually been playing around with it and it's getting to be one of my favorite lenses. Normally I shoot with the Canon FD lenses, but the one I picked up, actually got it for free, which is even better, is this little Vivitar. It's a 100mm f2.8 fixed focus. It's a prime lens. Um, image quality, it is comparable to the Canon FD except I think it gives a little bit richer color. Uh, very sharp, very clear, beautiful bokeh. Uh, the the, uh, the, the uh, bokeh that this lens produces is a perfect round orb, very soft, um, has a nice lens flare to it if you're out in bright lights. I, I did some sample tests, tried to get some uh, spotlight from the ceiling and so you could see the flare, but it's, it produces a very lovely um, green or not green but uh, purple and orange flare it's, it's real pretty I did some samples for you uh, try to get a close-up here so you can see let's see if this will focus there we go you can see right here here's the side of it very pretty. Now this thing, it's a M42 or a screw mount lens. So you'd have to get an adapter to be able to use it on pretty much any camera. I use it on my GH2, but you can see it's a, has a little pin on here. So it's not like the FD. Got to keep your little cap on here. Beautiful, beautiful lens. Um, if you're looking for a prime lens and a 100 millimeter, I'd suggest this. It's, it's a great little lens. Um, I know there's others out there like the, the Zeiss and some of the others, but I'm, you could probably pick this one up for a lot, lot less and still get very desirable results from it. Um, the thread on it is a 52 millimeter, if I believe, so you can put hoods on there or any type of filters, uh, ND or polarized filters. It has a little built-in hood. It's a very small one. I don't know if you can see it, but it, it pops out kind of help to prevent flares, but I usually leave it in so that way you can see the flares. Uh, beautiful lens. Tell you what, let's take a look at some of the shots. We, we were setting up a Christmas tree earlier, and so I took some shots of it near the tree so that way you can kind of see the, the way it looks as it's focusing in and out on the depth of the tree and a couple other shots. I think you'll like this lens. If you find it, uh, Highly recommend it. It's it, this thing is built solid. It's all all metal. There, there's not any plastic on it except may yeah lens hood built-in hood is is plastic. Other than that, this thing is solid. It's a very heavy lens, so you, you don't have to worry about you know it being real fragile and breaking. It, it's built pretty solid. But uh, I'll go ahead and let you take a look at these videos and see what you think. And then we'll be back in just a moment.
you looked at the video, you can see that it's a very sharp lens. Uh, you can fade in and out very easily, great depth of field. The bokeh from the Christmas lights, beautiful, nice round orbs. Uh, you saw the flare from the overhead light on the ceiling. I, I, I was going to take it out, I did some shots outside, but with, I didn't want to point it at the sun but it, I thought it would be easier in a, a room with a light so that way you can see the colors as they fade in and out but with the film it looks or as you're trying to film outside it's still just as beautiful so um, I hope you like the lens like I said it is a Vivitar 100 millimeter f 2.8 it's a, a m42 lens or a screw mount lens they're pretty popular if you like this video if you want to see a little bit more footage from it maybe some test shots outside or something like that just Leave me a comment below or like, follow. Feel free to share it. And uh, again, this is Paul Kepner with PK Productions, and I look forward to seeing you guys next time. Thanks.